Hey, what's going on everybody? Today I want to put a little video together showing you how to work with the GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition 2.7K resolution. Basically how to edit, um, how to get the best footage out of it, and um, basically high quality video. Um, I'm going to be using Adobe Premiere CS5 for this video. Uh, you can also use CS6, but uh, for this video I'll be using CS5. I'll show you how to set up the preset for that resolution because there isn't one built in and basically how to export it. All right, let's get started. All right, so when you're ready to set up a new project, um, basically you just wanna make sure you have HDV set, and here you have Mercury Playback Engine GPU Acceleration enabled, rather than the software only. This will use your video card to render all your video clips that need rendering. So we'll name this uh, project 2.7K Video Test 1, click OK. And uh, I already have two presets set, but I'll show you how to start a new one. Um, I like to start off at uh, digital SLR, 1080p. I'll just click click this for now and then go to general. And we'll change this to desktop. We'll leave this at 2997. And the resolution should be 2704 by 1440. Um, let me just double check that on one of my 2.7K videos. And we have 2.704 by 1440, so that's correct. Um, this you'll leave, uh, so yeah, square pixels. This will set to frames. And this is just your video preview. This could stay like that. And we'll save this preset as 2.7K res preset. Click OK. And we'll choose that and start a new project. Click OK. All right, so I currently have two clips in my timeline here that I shot a while back. They're both 2.7K uh, video video resolution. And say you're done editing your video and you want to export, so just go to File, Export, Export Media. And there is no, first of all, for the format, I like to choose H.264. I find I get the best, uh, clearest video quality out of that. And for the preset, there is no 2.7K preset here, so you're gonna have to do a custom one. First, you wanna go down to the level and increase that to 5.1. And now, you wanna, inc you wanna add the, uh, the correct resolution, which is 2704 by 1440. And the frame rate you wanna export at uh, 2997. And another thing you're gonna wanna do is uh, double check to see what the fir uh, the video bit rate is on your videos. Um, I think the typical is 46 megabits per second for the bit rate. See, I got 46 here. So that's what we want to set for the video. We want to do a target bit rate of 46, and we'll do a maximum bit rate of, let's say, 48 for this video. And I usually just leave uh, the one pass. If you do two passes, it's going to take twice as long to render out the whole video clip. And really, that's it. Um, choose your location on where you want to save it, and just click Save. Just go through all my stuff here. What do I got? GoPro, GoPro folder. Stuff to edit, and we'll do two. Uh, I don't know if I could do two points. So do twenty-seven oh four test. Test video clip, save, export, and that'll take about, I don't know, maybe 10 minutes, 5 10 minutes, or more. We'll see how it goes. All right, it just finished up, and I got my footage here. See if we could play it. And it looks pretty good. Just double check and see that it's actually 2.7K. We'll right click and go to Media Info. And that tells me that the resolution is 2704 by 1440 and the bit rate is 46.5. So that's, that's pretty awesome. That's exactly what I wanted. And the quality looks pretty good. Um, I notice I have problems playing my 2.7K videos with VLC media player, so 
I like to use um, Media Player Classic. Give that a try. It's it's pretty awesome. It plays like anything, literally. It does it doesn't even struggle with 2.7K footage while VLC player actually does. So now that I have the video exported, I want to upload it to YouTube and see what the uh, see if I get that original option, original footage option instead of 1080. Well, obviously 1080p will still be there, but you'll get another option for um, the 2.7K resolution. So we'll see how that goes now. All right, the video is done uploading. Uh, I didn't get the option for 2.7K or the original option until about three or four minutes after the video was finally uploaded. Uh, I guess it still had some processing to do behind the scenes. But if we go here, we should see the original option, and there it is. And that's basically 2.7K. Now, it's not really 2.7K because I have a 1080p monitor, and obviously that's not going to show 2.7K, but it's 2.7K in a 1080p monitor. So that's pretty much it. All right, so I hope you found that little tutorial helpful. Now you'll know how to export 2.7K, the highest quality. Um, if you have any other questions, just leave them down in the comments below. I get back to everybody. Um, so I think that's pretty much it. If you want, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter. I got Facebook. You could friend me on there if you want. Uh, you can ask me questions on there if you have any. Um, so that's pretty much it. Hope you enjoyed this. Share it if you think other people would find it helpful. Like the video. It helps me a lot. Uh, thanks for watching. See you next time.